We're assessing the active range of motion for the metacarpal phalange joint with a goniometer for flexion. So flexion is when you bend your finger down. We will start with the axis at the metacarpal phalange joint, which is the knuckle. The stationary arm is the midline dorsal of the metacarpal. And the movable arm is at the midline proximal phalange. Normal range of motion is 0 to 90 degrees. Bend your finger. And she's zero to seventy eight degrees. We are assessing the active range of motion for the metacarpal phalange joint with the goniometry for extension. The axis will be at the metacarpal phalange joint, the knuckle, the MCP. The stationary arm is at the midline dorsal of the metacarpal. And the movable arm is at the midline proximal phalange. Normal range of motion is 0 to 45. She is 0 to 38. We are assessing the active range of motion for the proximal interphalange joint with a goniometry for flexion. The axis will be on the proximal interphalange joint. The stationary arm is at the proximal phalange. And the movable arm is at the middle phalange. Normal range of motion is 0 to 100. And flexion is this. And she is zero to sixty eight. We're assessing the active range of motion with a goniometer for the proximal interphalange joint for extension. The range of motion is zero degrees, there is no norm for these. The axis is the proximal interphalange joint. The movable stationary arm is at the proximal phalange, and the movable arm is at the middle phalange. Her norm is 0 to 16 degrees. the active range of motion with a goniometer for the distal interphalange joint for flexion. Normal range of motion is 0 to 90 degrees. The axis will be on the distal interphalange joint, the dip joint. The stationary arm is at the dorsal midline of the middle phalange, and the movable arm is at the dorsal midline of the distal phalange. She is zero to fifty degrees. We are assessing active range of motion with a goniometer for the distal interphalange joint for extension. The normal range of motion is zero degrees, there is no norm, but you the axis will be at the distal interphalange joint, the dip joint. The stationary arm is at the dorsal midline middle phalange. And the movable arm is at the dorsal midline distal phalange. She is 0 to 20 degrees.